hello everybody and welcome thank you so much for joining me again it looks like we have another little bit of the story to discover the light faded from the sky and most were fast asleep mary would write about her family immortalizing them for future generations okay so we get a little bit of a peek in at mary which is pretty cool so mary and john are the parents and we have Linda, which is playing the violin up there in the corner. And somewhere there should be Will, I believe. In the last episode, he uh, ran off after getting some knives from Uncle Ben. And unfortunately was left there and uh, kind of got a cut scene there that I missed. But he came back with a bounty. He went down through the caves, was able to manage his, uh, manage himself, but uh, Mary and John were a little upset with him, but, um, you know, given that he was able to manage himself, uh, they went ahead and trained him, and now he is an option. So we got John, the father, Linda, the daughter, uh, sword, bow, and now little oh kevin i was thinking it was will little kevin uh ran off is the one that ran off and uh he is uh he has a couple little knives so let's uh run in and uh see what uh, kevin is all about okay kevin is quick and stealthy which he hit he stacks frenzy the more frenzy he has the quicker his attacks become the color of his frenzy bar changes Representing the amount of frenzy frenzy depletes over time. Okay. Well, that's cool. So we got a little Okay, and then we've got our Improperly. Yeah, we could do that as well. And then we probably has his yeah, His role so it looks like he has a lot maybe even more than Linda has but uh, definitely uh, pretty cool here he has two, maybe three to uses of his evade, which is cool. Quick and uh, stealthy, which is awesome. I love the individual characters in this. Not only the ca characters are unusual, but uh, also um, they're very um, different in not only style, but also, um, you know, uh, how they run, their looks. Uh, that sort of thing. Their art style is as uh, separate as their combat styles, which is amazing. I am really, really impressed with this, with how they have made these characters very individualistic here in this family. Um, very impressed with that. And it looks like each hit stuns them a little bit as well, which is exceedingly cool as well. Steps were taken without regret, for it was never possible to change a destiny unknown. Oh, this is the one that I think we hit, we pick a button, basically. It gives us some enemies, and we might get the bonus there as well. So that looks like it gave us nothing. That was the wrong step. So, oh well, I guess that's the way it goes. Uh, I don't know how much I'm going to be playing with... Um, What's this do? Hold on, let's see what this does really quick. We see some more experience for a limited amount of time. Well, let's grab that. Experience is always good. Um, I don't know how much I'm going to be playing with uh, the close combat people. Uh, definitely is not my uh, forte. Uh, I would rather be just playing uh, Linda all the way through, but I also think that I should at least show some of the other characters out. Maybe uh, some of you guys are um not ranged people so i would like to you know experience ev all the characters he is definitely really cool i like him more than john but um we'll have to just see how this all goes out let me see if i can pull up my skills so what do we got okay so we get a more uh frenzy or we could do Release a flurry of knives in all directions around Kevin. That looks pretty nice. I am going to think that that's probably his Y power. Um, let's go ahead and do that. Hopefully, yeah, that unlocks that. That's what I was kind of expecting there. Um, they all each have a 
kind of a special power up uh, determined by why um, that's like the power up button um, Linda's and uh, John's are uh, very similar uh, in that they both a uh, you know rain down um, you know arrows or um, uh, you know swords and that's kind of how those two their two actions work uh, we'll have to see maybe here when Kevin gets a little bit of some character creatures around him maybe not maybe we'll just try it out and see what it does now that we got the skill we can use it kind of whenever we want to like here oh it was a little uh jump spin looking thing there that was kind of nice i was in heavy uh combat there so let's just see what it does Boo! okay so that's kind of nice uh throw some knives out around me uh that way we can uh hit a little bit of all those enemies a little bit his blades have a a wide arc not as much as the uh, sword that John has, but I definitely like the the kind of uh, wide arc that the knives are taking. And the knives are are not nasty looking, like backwards bending. I mean, those knives are pretty sweet looking. Gotta say, these bats are annoying. It's all I want things just to attack me, run up and hit me in the face, or try to. These bats uh, seem to have a little bit of a uh path ai to kind of try to fool you which is cool i gotta say i am uh again very impressed with this game have been quite impressed with this game uh since i first picked it up and played it let's check oh he's frenzying did you see him like blinking that was kind of cool um let's go ahead and uh throw one into frenzy so we have that ability as well. And then we have all kinds of abilities up here that we can get into, which is gonna be fun. A lot of fun to explore and see what's what. What is this? Instantly heals. Okay, we are not terribly hurt. Um, that's just basically a health potion. We're doing pretty good right now. So um, I think we will wait on that. He's definitely fast with these knives and is definitely doing a lot of qu really quick damage here, which is nice. Um, he seems almost like John and John and him could be pretty good uh, straight up um, front fighters. Um, Linda, of course, has to run back a little bit more uh, just because the range attack is not as strong. Uh, it seems like uh, maybe that's just me, but uh, we'll see how that goes. And what do we got here? Creates a vortex that pulls enemies in. Ooh, I love that. Let's just get rid of enemies. <laughs> yeah, he seems to be going through the area rather quickly, which is good. Linda has a lot of backtracking and maybe I'm not using her skills quite right here um but yeah she seems to have a lot of uh backtrack i'm watch trying to watch for those uh spikes there getting ready to do that role that his role was different as well he has a uh almost a a front roll kind of uh attack whoa that was close i saw you buddy and uh we're going to try to be really careful and clear out a little bit around that guy I saw one of those kind of powered up guys, which you gotta be careful about. What does this do? That's just a charm, awesome. Uh, let's see what this thing does here. That just pulled that guy in, oh, no, almost. Almost pulled him in, run. Oh, no, not quite, not quite, oh gosh. That will hurt them, which is gonna be a little bit of decent. Um, this, he's gonna be hard. Uh, this guy's going to be hard because of, I think, his... Oh, we're almost dead here. Oh, no. Run, run. I uh, wonder if I could run him into the spikes a little bit. This... Uh, get that guy away from me. Run. Oh, he's got some of the spiders away from me, at least. Uh, but this guy is definitely going to be a little bit more of a challenge. Uh, I need that. 
I really could use that health potion right there. Woo. The problem with the spikes is I have to have them really close to me to get the spikes to work out. Okay. He's doing it. He's doing it. Come on. Ooh, got to hit. Oh, gosh. Oh, no, little Kevin. We didn't make it. I think we're going to come back with Linda, though, and see if we can get a little bit better and a little bit farther with her. Okay, let's see if there's anything. Yeah, okay, let's get a little bit of Linda's story here. Nothing could quite match the calm that Linda felt when playing her violin. Its sublime sound, the perfect counter to the nerve-wracking uncertainty and chaos. Okay. Cool, cool. I like it. I like it. Does not look like there's any more. So let's go down. And uh, we also got to check out to make sure that Linda has all her skills powered up. And that's going to be important to make sure that's working out right. Okay, let's see. Okay, we do have... Okay, we don't have any abilities open or any skill points to use. But we do have some other things that we can... Let me see if I can get here. We could... we Once we get some, we could, we could definitely power some of these up. That's what I wanted to check really quickly. I don't know. See, she's already backing up. And again, I don't know. Will, uh, not Will. I keep on wanting to say Will. Kevin seemed to be able to go through uh, that kind of group much easier than she has. So I don't know if I ran in there too quickly on some of those. Uh, but it seems like Will and... Um, John has a much, much better ability to take out or go through or fight through a large group. Again, that's not going to be terribly helpful uh, for me because most you don't want the, the enemies to be close to me. That's um, that's kind of uh, defeats the purpose of being ranged here. Steps were taken without regret, for it was never possible to change a destiny unknown. Oh, oh yeah, I got it. I don't know what it is, but I got it, I think. What I get, what I get, what I get. Ring of ambition. Corpses have less chance to get corrupted and spawn enemies. I didn't even know that was a thing. Huh. That's kind of cool. So let's, uh... So it looks maybe if I kill uh bats or skeletons they get a chance to uh be um turn into those little corruption things I, I i i'm guessing here is what it looks like what is this move a greater something i missed that i didn't read it greater speed i think is what i was going and then uh it probably was at a cost of something and I probably should have read, read that a little bit more closely. I could probably stand my ground a little bit better than what I do here. Um, do a little bit more agile or wondering, you know, going in circles rather than just straight up uh, backing up every time will probably save me a little bit of time. But I still got to save. I don't know where they are, but there are... I think there's two other uh, recipe items I need to save... Um, the uh cub so we need to look for those as well that's kind of why i'm not going uh straight down every time um something also that you need to note is that like this it requires a gemstone when i was down here with kevin i picked up a gemstone but because it is it was kevin kevin has the gemstone and not linda so there is a little bit Oh, while a lot of the stuff is, or some of the stuff is shared, there is uh, definitely as well, um, you know, items that uh, they pick up that is not, I wouldn't say unique to them, but they have it. So they have that gemstone. Um, 
Kevin has that gemstone and um, not Linda. So you got to make sure that, you know, the character that you are playing has the gemstone if uh, you're trying to, you know, get or have a, uh, um, you know, use such an item. I really would like to have an item on her that's a knockback. That would be awesome. I think that would be really nice just to be able to shoot these people um, and keep them at, uh, a little bit better at bay. Probably should use just go ahead and use that and kill some people. There we go. Hit him. She needs more stamina too. That's probably another thing I need to look at. Let's uh, clear these out before I tried to read these because the nasties will not wait. Instantly heal. I'm full of health. Unfortunately, when I went to that last time, uh, I went down a floor and didn't really need it. I would, could have used it really a lot there with uh, Kevin earlier. Yeah, Kevin earlier. Uh, but um, it was not in the right spot at the right time, unfortunately. He still probably doesn't have a gemstone. There is a little bit of not back to her bow, but I would have really cared for uh, a little bit more here. Or maybe that's one of the abilities she gets uh, as she goes up in in um, um, you know skills, one of her upper skill levels. I also like that the not all the enemies. Like, like with the bat and some of these other ones, uh, the enemies, especially those little corrupted guys, um, their attacks are not straightforward. And while I uh, kind of jokingly uh, mentioned it with the uh, bats, I think that's really cool little thing that they do is to make it poisons damaged enemies. Well, let's pick that up. That's cool. Um, I like that the... the uh, enemies have a little bit of an AI there, not just straight beat, beat, beat. They have uh, kind of an attack pattern that uh, you, maybe you need to figure out a little bit of it, but it also, you know, they'll they'll parry uh, dodges. Most of them will. The skeletons are kind of got dumb, I guess, but most of them have a little bit of a, a attack pattern that um, uh, kind of... Uh, you know, uh, they'll, they'll parry or dodge or run around you or something to that effect to kind of damage you a little bit more. I really like this poison damage and I hope it sticks with me because that might help me quite a bit in the uh, skeleton round or the uh, um, spider's lair. I would really like to get through that. But then again, it's, it's fun just to explore these levels a little bit over and over and see what this is all about. What can I get? Increases luck. Well, there we go. Let's do that. Ah, shoot. That was kind of dumb. I sat there right at the right at the wrong time to shoot that. That's another thing you got to be careful about. You that thing does uh, damage to you or well, her arrow doesn't do damage to her to you, but you've got to make sure you got to know that it stops you. You are, you're not moving while you shoot that arrow up in the air. Okay, it's a totem that slows enemies. That might help me out too. It, it depends on the radius of that. Oh, I got hit there and I didn't want to get hit there. Is that going to get some of them? Hopefully. There we go. That was a good move. I was, I used it enough right there. Uh, that he swung at me and I had that shot and it was right next to me. So that was a very, very uh, lucky shot. A little bit planned, a little bit luck. I'll be honest with you guys. It's not always just uh, planned. You get a little bit of luck in here when you when you time things out. Get that spider away from me. Ah! Right. Ooh, what's this? Enemies do ferocious enemies do reduce damage um, You know, I think I'm gonna switch that I'm not sure what the difference in ferocious enemies are, but I think I want to try that one instead Oh right on his head. Oh, 
and that does poison him. That's one of the things I was going to try out is does the um, arrow attack, the special arrow attack, uh, give off poison as well. And it does appear that it does. I may have looked at that wrong, but I thought it did. Oh, from the spider, that was kind of cool. Get some money! Money, 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 money! I want the Spider King. Okay. Yes, it does. Okay, I did not... Yes, so the arrow attack uh, definitely gives off uh, poison damage, which is going to be very helpful, I do believe. I do not like these guys. These guys right there. Ugh. Oh, is there two of them? It almost looked like there was two of them right now. Or right there. The, I don't know. It was the, uh, the way the, I don't know, the um, marking was on it, I guess. It just looked like there was two of them. Ooh, nice hit on that spider. And again, you got to be careful. You don't always want to attack. It's not always the best to attack the uh, Nair's. Uh, creature, as you saw there, it was better for me to attack the, um, um, the, um, spider instead of the bat that was kind of messing around there, so, <clears throat> that's something, you know, just something a little bit with the, uh, ranged attacks that you gotta get used to. I would like to have a higher crit chance. I bet you anything... That that door leads to the spider layer. I think that hit the spider back down there. Uh, it looks like you get a little bit of a bonus for like uh, so many kills over ouch um, over a certain amount of time. Uh, if you do a lot of kills quickly, you get a bonus uh, damage and. Um, uh, maybe a bonus damage something it appears that there is some kind of uh activation or or a benefit to getting multiple um uh, kills quickly okay let's one of these is gonna lead to the spider layer let's see what we could find out here hopefully we'll be able to clear that she is a little bit slower it, i i would think but I don't know. I don't know. I definitely like her. I like her better. I like her just the, the I've always liked it, you know, in Diablo and in many of the other games I've played. Uh, ranged has always been my favorite uh, attack style. Oh, I'm in a little bit of trouble here. We got some baddies on me. Pretty, pretty bad baddies. Um... Would love to get that guy poisoned a little bit. There we go. We took care of him. We had to back up a little bit. We, but we uh, showed that guy who's boss money, and that guy should be. Oh, I thought he was uh, uh, killed already, which is not the case. Oh, that's the one I heard. Okay, that one up there. Okay. I'm actually doing really good here. Let's see if we can get Is there another one. Holy crap. They're coming out of everywhere. Ah, I hate those little guys because they they shoot off uh, uh, babies. That's one of the things I don't like most about them. I mean, even like here, a nice quick shot to that back. Uh, big spider starts poison damage on him and it Before really is helpful. Old was a game of chance you know i'm not gonna mess with that i'm gonna just stay with what i have i'm pretty happy with what i have and i don't really want to go through fighting a bunch of those that one's an annoying one because what it does is you got those four buttons and you have to figure out the um the um pattern of the button so if you get the pattern wrong you gotta redo it um so it takes, not only takes a lot of time to usually figure it out, but it, um, uh, there's a lot of enemy fights there and it's, uh, a little frustrating. 
Okay, there. Oh, yes, another. Uh, it looks like. Oh, shoot. Fighter. Let's get him done. Oh, gosh. I got definitely a lot of health potions around here, it looks like. So. Um, I don't think I'll have to worry here about. This looks like um, another one of the. I would have to say another one of the healing for the. Uh, Ingredients we need for the whatchamacallit the um There could not have been a more perfect description of this root than its name Cave web <laughs> Cave Rather web. bland to the taste It was still edible and full of nutrients Or the uh, cub that's what I was trying to think of We got to try to save that I'm gonna run up here and make sure I am full health. Here we go. Let's go fight the Spider Queen, I guess. The shopkeeper said he would like to offer a discount for his rescue, but there had not been many customers lately. We'll check out his shop in just a second after I destroy all of his meticulously placed pots here. There we go. Okay, so what do we got here? Double... Deal double damage while your health is below 25%. Totem of Deception. Creature that distracts all enemy. I think slow might be a better one. I don't need health. Increases your dodge chance. Increases your movement speed. Three. Do I have three? I do have three. The only bad thing about this is that... I don't keep them. I'm going to try the dodge chance. Let's go with that. Poison and dodge chance. And then I got this thing to suck enemies into the darkness. Hopefully that will help me out a little bit. Hopefully, it, because I run in the circles a lot, hopefully the, uh, this, um, totem will help me out quite a bit. Ooh. Up every divine relic after it is used with another random one. Um, um, no, yeah, sure, why not? Let's go ahead and set that and see what happens. Can I grab that one and then hit that? I don't know exactly how that works, but let's go for it. All eight eyes studied the one so willing to walk into their own tomb. I just gotta try to keep as much movement going on as possible, especially uh, while she She's oh I got none of them up in the air. Move. Oh yeah. Okay, I don't think she's getting poisoned, but definitely uh helpful. Um oh shoot, that was close. I think if I could just keep it up here, uh we might Oh shoot. I'm not sure what that did, but I'm in trouble, I think. Oh, run! Okay, let's keep moving. Maybe we can get... I think I got really lucky there with that one. Um, not getting much. Oh, oh no, so much better. Well, well, maybe I'll do a couple runs and see if we can get a little bit more gold and stuff. And hopefully be able to do something uh better so thank you guys so much for watching hopefully soon we'll be able to kill the spider thank you and uh see you next time bye everybody